Hi everyone, welcome back to Rocksteady. Tracy here and I have one of these Dolce Gusto machines. Well, I, actually I do have a couple of these machines. So um, these are all my pods. I've got quite a lot of others in the cupboard, but I've got these um, little things to, to put them in and there they are. So um, they can be fairly expensive you can get them quite inexpensively as well in um, some sort of shops uh, some of the cheaper shops around but you can't always get the ones you want so I was quite intrigued when I saw um, a little pop-up on my uh, may have been Facebook feed I don't know but it was for this kit that you can buy and here it is now you can make your own coffee um, make your own coffee pods and here they are you get a couple of scoops and you get these pods so I'm going to undo that bear with me a second while I just pause it okay so here they are and you they they open how do they open let's see they just pop open and they've got this little hinge and they don't look very sturdy at all those hinges look like they'll break. You do get four in this particular pack, but they are, as you can see inside, um, exactly the same as, I, I guess, the inside of one of these pods. So it doesn't give you any instructions, which is not very helpful. I'm going to switch on my machine um, and I'm going to use this scoop and I'm going to pop in some um, coffee from the coffee that we've been using in our filter and I'm going to put in um, two scoops because we have mugs okay so let's investigate whether these things actually work live um, on on camera and so they better had hadn't they so um, let's find a nice cup shall we uh, this one says best ever mum so yeah that might be a good one to try it with let me just move my camera over a smidge. There we go. Nice view of my pen collection. So I've got my little cup. I'm going to put my... I'm very nervous about this for some reason. I'm popping that in the machine. It doesn't want to close. Why do you not want to close? Maybe I haven't... I need to line it up. I don't know. That's not a good start, is it? It doesn't close at all. Now, why is that, do you think? Let's have a look at one of the actual pods. Fits in exactly the same. There's nothing in there. It's a, a rigid plastic. So I'm trying to line up that hole um, at the back there. Maybe I need to line it up at the front. Let's try moving. It doesn't say there are no instructions whatsoever. So there we go. We turn it round. Ah, there you go. Why there's no instructions so obviously when you buy these this little hole needs to be at the front not the back i thought the piercer would be there but it's actually there so that's what makes the hole in one of these standard pods so you just need to make sure that you line this up at the front okay now we'll switch on now my machine does make a lot of noise it's a bit old so far so good look at that wow Okay, it's getting very weak though, isn't it? <laughs> it's getting very weak already. Maybe I need to fill that up. See, it didn't say, did it? Which is very, very annoying. I'm going to stop it because, well, I feel like maybe we've got enough. It'll drip into my drip tray. So it looks like coffee. Let me just get a little bit of sweetener because I don't think I can bear it without. It's got half a spoon. Give it a little stir. I'm going to have, try it black. So let's have a go. That is really good. That is really good. So it's just a case of trial and error with these, these pods because they don't give you instructions, which is really, really unhelpful. I guess you fill it up then. You must have to fill up this whole cavity. So let's undo another one. Un un it undoes by this end not the end where the hole is and then there you are so I figured because I wasn't um I don't know maybe I'd just 
didn't understand perhaps that you have to fill it up but there's you know it would be helpful to have some kind of instructions and for some reason I'll have two scoops in this pack um there you go that's it tastes absolutely amazing I'm really impressed actually um not impressed with the fact that you don't get any instructions with it whatsoever there's nowhere to get any either I I saw this pop up on my Facebook feed and I don't buy from Facebook it doesn't matter what it is I I just don't buy from Facebook at all so um I then go search for the same thing I, I click on it find out the name and then I get on Amazon or I'll just google it and find where they sell them where I trust and so I bought these I think they were from Amazon they were very very inexpensive I'll just check how much Okay, well, I had a look and I ordered them from eBay, actually, and they were £3.69 for this four. It does say they were £4 something, but they weren't. When I sent it through the checkout, it came up at £3.69. So that's not actually too bad, is it? £3.69, you get four. And it does say that on the listing that they are reusable. I had a look on the listing to see if there were any instructions for use in there or not. So um, I think it's very easy to break these if you didn't know how to undo them that is very very flimsy that connector so it would be really really easy to to break them they've got a filter you can see that just just see that filter in the bottom there that fil filters the coffee but i actually think they're a brilliant little idea i'm very impressed with them i like them a lot i'll definitely order these again so this coffee was my favorite lavazza which you know you can't get in the actual pods for the machine so the fact that i can get and, and i don't really i don't really drink that much coffee but when i do i like it to be one that i really really enjoy i can't just pick up any coffee and think oh that's okay i'll drink that it's got to be absolutely the one that i enjoy so and that is that that lavazza is my favorite coffee so i've been quite pleased with uh, these so far apart from the fact that it doesn't tell you how to make your perfect cup of coffee now don't drink coffee much so that little bit that I've made is really enough for me I could have used a much smaller cup in fact I do have some small glass ones which I probably should have used but um yeah fill up the fill up the chamber and reuse them but be careful when you wash them or you will be buying replacements now when I did look at the listing they did have buy one pack for so much buy two packs it's cheaper buy three packs it's cheaper still so they have those offers on there there are lots of them um lots of them not just one person selling them they're all over but they do also have them I think on Amazon so yeah they're, they're all in all really really good I like them a lot just wish there was some instructions that would have been that would have been handy to find out how much coffee to put in and how to insert this so that that is at the front of your machine then um yeah would have been easier wouldn't it never mind i suppose these little little trials and tribulations make it more fun thanks for watching if you haven't already don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell and hopefully you'll be informed when new videos or live streams pop up thanks for watching i'll see you on the next one bye for now